Greetings! Welcome to Jesus and Mary Inseparable. The topic of this video is NASA's discovery that the moon is inside the Earth's atmosphere. As always, let us begin with a short prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Jesus and Mary, we love you. Save souls, especially ours. Amen. All right, this is my desktop screensaver. Uh, short prayer, be beautiful short prayer here. Thank you, my beloved. You live in me and I live in you. Uh, say this short prayer after receiving Jesus' body and blood in Holy Communion. And you will save 1,000 sinners every time. 1,000 souls. Anyway, back to the topic. This is the RT News website. Uh, staggering discovery reveals moon lies inside the Earth's atmosphere. Now then, everybody was taught, as is from a small child, that the Earth, like this picture here, has a small atmosphere, a thin atmosphere, and uh, that the moon is hundreds of thousands of miles away in this vacuum of outer space. That's another point, actually, because uh, how can you have this vacuum uh, without a protective barrier wall for the Earth. This vacuum would suck everything out, all the air, away from the Earth. You can't have a vacuum without this, uh, without some sort of uh, barrier wall to protect the Earth. So the globe systems clearly doesn't work. But that's another topic. That's another video. Um, I want to show uh, these two pictures here. This is possibly a better image of the distance, clearer portrayal of the uh, distance. And this picture here, this possibly is a good one too. Uh, so the moon is supposedly hundreds of thousands of miles away, but the, the Earth only has a sliver of atmosphere, we were always taught. But now they're saying the moon, the Earth's atmosphere extends way out here which is uh, bordering on madness. But it's true what they're saying, the, the, the moon does lie inside the Earth's atmosphere. All flat earthers know that. But uh, globe earthers are going to be forced to uh, start thinking twice about the globe Earth system. Hopefully they're going to be shaking in their boots with this news because uh, what they were taught is being shattered basically by this article, by this discovery. Let me read some of this article. The Earth's atmosphere is much bigger than previously thought, extending far beyond the moon, a team of scientists have revealed. The amazing discovery was made thanks to data that has been sitting unexamined for over 20 years. We now know that the atmosphere surrounding our planet stretches 391,000 miles away, well that's lonely of course, and is 50 times the diameter of Earth. Thanks to the discovery and analysis of decades old data by scientists at Russia's Space Research Institute. So we thank you Russia for releasing this information. And my guess is that uh, Russia is doing this to get back at the globalists because as we know the globalists uh, are trying to demonize russia so i reckon this is russia's clever way of getting back at the globalists uh, this bit here is some stupid advert uh it means that the moon is part of our atmosphere and not outside of it in fact it's actually located right in the middle of our atmosphere an average distance of 238,000 miles from the Earth. Well, that number is baloney. baloney. The moon flies through Earth's atmosphere, explained Igor Balyukin of Russia's Space Research Institute. See, this is the diagram they're giving. This is the Earth. This is the moon. And now this is the atmosphere of Earth. <laughs> Outrageous. So where, where does the vacuum stop previously the vacuum went right up to earth right around here but now they're saying the vacuum stops around here for some reason outrageous it just make things up as they go along 
But uh, what they're saying is true. The moon is inside the Earth's atmosphere. And this footage, this footage what I'm going to show you now, clearly shows that the moon is very close. Not hundreds of thousands of miles away, as they say. It's close. Look, this is real footage, people. This is footage from Canada, somewhere around there. And uh, clearly see the moon is clear. You wouldn't be able to see the moon that clear if it was hundreds and thousands of miles away. Look how clear you can see these uh, craters. Look, this one. Look at that one. So clear. That one's so clear. Clear. All that you can see. And if you get a simple camera, a binoculars, telescope even, you can zoom in on it and see it even more clearly. And you wouldn't be able to do that if it was hundreds and thousands of miles away. Binoculars cannot see hundreds and thousands of miles away. Our eyes cannot see hundreds and thousands of miles away. And uh, another point to add is that uh, this path is part of a circular path. This line I'm drawing with my cursor is part of a huge circle. See? The uh, sun and the moon, they circle around above us on the flat earth. This is the flat earth. Or just say this is the flat earth. Then the sun and the moon circling around us up here. And as the Bible says, God made the two great lights and placed them inside the dome. He made the stars and he placed them inside the dome. Genesis 1. There's a few verses in Genesis chapter 1 that says that mentions the dome. The earth is a dome. The ancient uh, Israelites, the first people on earth, they all knew that the earth was a dome. And the earth is still a dome. Wicked people are trying to change the truth, trying to make us disbelieve the Bible. The Bible is God's book, God's word. Everything in it is true and right. Brother, Son, Sister Moon, how beautiful you are. Give praise to the glory of God. Give praise to God. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. All his works bless the Lord. So beautiful. This moon is definitely inside the sky. Sometimes you can see it, it looks transparent. And that's another proof that the moon is inside the atmosphere. And it's close by, it's clearly close, not far away. All right, so hope that's helped. Hope you like that. That was a nice footage of the beautiful moon. And this is outrageous what they're saying. But uh, this is not outrageous. This is true. Staggering discovery reveals moon lies inside the Earth's atmosphere. That's what they do. They mix the truth with lies. But this is the true part. And this is the false part, the globe Earth. So anyway, let's finish up with a short prayer. Jesus and Mary, we love you, save souls, especially ours. Amen. This is Jesus and Mary signing out.